All right, guys, welcome to the stream. I'm back, and how's it going? I've just been away for a little bit, mainly resting, also doing game research. And this evening, we're going to be playing a game called Combat Task Force 121. This is a first person military shooter that came out in 2005 developed by Groove Games and City Interactive, also known as CI Games. Um, this is an American or Canadian slash American company. Uh, pretty straightforward. Also came out on the original Xbox um, when I was looking it up. So... This ought to be a pretty straightforward, probably jank fun one for you guys. Um, I was gonna add something else, but I guess we'll get started. I was gonna say, sort of back to my roots of uh, these weird first person shooters, I guess, or these, uh, sort of bargain bin titles. So, uh, let's begin. Combat. Semicolon. Task Force 121. All right. Um, task. There we go. Check my volume. After probably put it all the way down, honestly. There we go. It's coming up. Groove Games 2005. Get the usual online experience notice. Um, that's pretty loud for you guys, isn't it? Definitely touching the yellow. I don't want it to overpower my voice. AMD 64. Good old days. Alright, we got a. <laughs> End-game trailer, right at the beginning, look at this. This is the type of game I want to jump straight into, it's just so much action. It's military, it's generic, and I like it. Alright. Surely they could have shown something a little more detailed than this. <sighs> but I digress. Alright, that's our trailer. Probably gonna chuck it down, like a bump. Alright, maybe to there. Alright, let's begin. New profile. Name. I am SGT Johnny. Difficulty normal. Create profile. Alright, we're gonna go campaign. Operation Iron Harpoon. And, um, we get a, a briefing, I guess. After this loading screen. All right. After years of slowly simmering unrest, the Marxist rebels have obtained a foothold within the armed services and found sympathetic comrades to lend both a voice and weapons. While a full-blown coup d'etat is not yet underway, a few early, high-profile rebel victories could quickly turn the tide. U.S. forces have been called in to put a halt to these high-profile terrorist acts against the U.S. interests. Your first action will be on a U.S.-owned oil platform just off the coast. Rebels have taken the crew hostage and placed charges. You need to find the hostages and secure the oil platform. Okay. You will have the element of surprise until the first shots are fired. 
All right, the usual rescue hostages. And of cor course, first and After foremost, slowly simmering unrest. shut up. Kill everything that moves, or anything that moves. All right, let me adjust my mouse sensitivity. There's always a thing in these games where the mouse is way too fast. All right, that's, a, that's better. Rescue the hostages. All right, let's go. Of course, we can aim down sights. We can't run in this game, which is weird. And when he aims down the sights, he just you just kind of see the uh, I don't know. You just see immediate sights. There's no real aim down. So it's weird. All right. Uh. All right. F is search. Sixteen rounds of pistol ammo. I haven't played an FPS in so long. Alright, can I- Oh, you can aim down sights like that. So there's sights, and then sights. Like proper sights. Um, right, let me check my controls. Wonder what action is. Search, use as F. Okay, so I guess I'm just like bumping doors and levers slash switches to like activate things. We'll see. It's kind of awkward how this game doesn't have a run. Okay. Just getting warmed up here. With the controls and what have you. Okay, so I'm, yeah. Alright. I I didn't notice the prompt. But our doors make a distinct clicking sound. Alright, janitor's closet. Alright, I think the audio is perfect. Oh no. That's what I'm worried about. That, uh... The, the search mechanic. Because it takes so long to, like, search things. Can I go in the cabinet? No, this game is... It's too cheap to, uh, for further searching options. Right, let's go down. Going down and down on the ship. Okay, so you gotta be like really specific for the props. You found a combination. Alright, have I seen any safes? We got like an inventory? This is weird. Oh, a combination for the door here. Okay. Alright. Let's see. How would I, like, use this? Check my controls. Search use. Uh... I'll shoot it. Combination? I need, um, it's like I need a key card. Okay, so there's probably a safe somewhere. Let's go back in here. Uh, 
Look for a safe, I guess. Oh, you can shoot out windows. Okay. Yikes. Our dude isn't very good at, uh... Walking upstairs. I seem to have a problem with these games and stairs. Oh, we can go on here. Okay, here's a save. Access? You picked up a security card. Okay. So there is a little bit of, like, interactive, interactable environment going on, I guess. You gotta kind of have that keen eye. Um, okay, there are checkpoints. I don't think there's any saving in this game. Authorized. Okay. Let's continue. Checkpoint saved. Okay, rescue hostages. Gain access to the crew quarters. Those are my objectives. So it seems like the checkpoints are going to be fair at least. Search you. Take your way to engineering, okay. Wait, what the heck is that magazine? I'm, I'm about to just... I'm gonna check it out. Ribs World. The Rib King. <laughs> Top 10 rib recipes. Who the heck is that on the cover? And... Doghouse. How to make a real hot dog. Number one best. Ribs... Hot soup. And we got, uh, Devil Juice. Maybe I should, uh, call up Devil Juice. I like how the... It's like a, um, a, on the side as well. They just kind of copy and pasted. Take me? Alright. No, you're playing a good game when you got, um... Developers inside jokes here. Okay. Locked. Locked. We've also got different weapons as well. Like, we got a pistol. We got a knife. Which, uh, we're gonna stick him. Stick him. <laughs> like how he just twists it. Not just simple animation. So we got... It's weird how that appears twice. Oh, so one is grenades. And the other is just, um, general assault rifle. Okay. I'm gonna knife someone. We got the ribs there. The mouse is still kind of sensitive. Oh, we got devil juice in the flesh. Yo, give me some of that. What's this? It looks like a kung fu magazine? I can't really tell. I can try and zoom in. He looks like he's doing something with his hand. A little pixelated. Oh! The knife one-shots! That's awesome. Alright. Ammo acquired for assault rifle. Okay, we're in the shower rooms. Who's in here? Alright, got him. More hallways. Ah, oh, you shouldn't have game. Oh, uh, well, I guess we're going this way. Okay. I'm gonna guess locked. Also, I wonder if there are medkits.
Sounds like there's something stuck in the wall. Like this weird kind of tap 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 sound. Well, let's keep going. Unstoppable force here. Locked, huh? Alright. Gonna try the pistol for a little bit. Hey, there's keys. Alright, picked up the keys. Let's go back to our door then. Checkpoint shaved, Mr. Bond. Alright, cool. Locked. Horse. That guy really tried to hit me through that. Seemed like it. Search you. Thirteen rounds. Climb through air ducts. Rescue hostages. Okay, cool. We are well on our way. We must find the air ducts now. Seriously, this guy cannot climb stairs for the life of him. He's got footstep collision. His feet are just so, like, springy. Just made of rubber. Oh, well, we got- we got a computer, we got a calculator, we got a pencil. Generic tower. Let's go through the ducks. Quack, quack. Objectives completed. Okay, I think it's just the hostages now that I have to rescue. Oh, I'll go up here. Search this dude. Look at this guy. Oi, nice kicks, dude. Let me guess. Thought I would open it on the other side, but no. Picked up a security keycard. Exactly what I need. Probably for this. Open sesame. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Didn't mean to fire a grenade. Also, I don't know if there's any health in any of the levels. It just goes by like checkpoints. Okay. Oh, hostages! Objectives updated. Alright, we completed the mission. It just fades out. Alright. <laughs> the terrorists have been detonating charges on the oil platform. If they all explode, the results could be both a financial and ecological disaster. Much of your path off the oil platform has been blocked by debris and fire. You will need to find alternate routes and disarm the explosives you find on the way. Ooh, all right. Disarm explosives mission. Escape the burning rig. Did my sound just go off? Hold on a minute. 
Uh, restart from checkpoint? Yeah, what? It's like a sound bug. Do I have to restart the game? What the heck? Exit to Windows. Okay. That is a weird bug. Oh, let me just restart that for a second. What is going on? Load profile. Campaign. Operation Burning Justice. Okay, let's try and reload this. There we go. I had to restart the damn game to get my sound back. Disarm the explosive. Okay. I love that fan JPEG. It's like lower res than anything else around me. It's funny. Whoa, shit! Right, well, the rig is exploding around me, so... Escape the burning rig, disarm explosives. Fine, take it. How's it going, Microtwist? Welcome to the stream. Thank you very much for the 26 month resub. I really appreciate it. I will take that. And good morning, sir. How you doing? We are playing Combat Task Force 121. This is a city interactive military shooter. Also developed by Groove Games. Came out on the original Xbox as well. Having breakfast? Nice. Anything good for breakfast? Right, disarm the first explosive here. Broccoli pie. That's a uh, interesting breakfast. Broccoli pie, huh? Oh, I can turn that off. Uh, what else does broccoli pie have in it? Is that like a leftover or? Cheese and eggs, yum. I've uh, definitely had something like that. My mum used to make. Oh! Take it! I wonder how many... ...charges we got to, uh... ...clip and defuse here. <clears throat> Okay. Yeah, this this whole rig has gone to heck. I gotta disarm. Disarm explosive. Okay, we got one more explosive. And then escape the burning rig. So looking round here. Shit! There's a lot of jump scares. This game shouldn't be jump scaring me. Okay, reload. It's probably gonna be one up here. Nope. That box is different. I thought I could shoot it. Oh boy. Alright, there's the uh, last explosive. Let's disarm that. 
And uh, now we just need to escape the rook. Ow. Don't exactly know where to escape, but we'll find it. Here we go. This wasn't open before. Like this. Almost freedom. It's weird how I can't climb that. Ah, there's another one to defuse. Objectives updated. Okay, I think we did it. It should fade out now. Mission completed. Alright, what have we got the now? The oil platform has been secured, but the rebels have retained their hold on the oil refinery. This refinery supplies fuel for all of the islands, and the excess oil provides nearly 22% of the island's export revenue and represents a significant financial investment. You need to secure the refinery and keep losses to a minimum. Perfect. All right, I'll be right back. One second. The oil the platform has will keep repeating. The rebels have retained their hold the on the oil refinery. Oh, hold on. This refinery supplies fuel for all of the islands, and the excess oil provides nearly 22% of the island's export revenue and represents a significant financial investment. You need to secure the refinery and keep losses to a minimum. The oil platform has been secured, but the rebels have retained their hold on the oil refinery. This refinery supplies fuel for all of the islands, and the excess oil provides nearly 22% of the island's export revenue and represents a significant financial investment. You need to secure the refinery and keep losses to a minimum. The oil platform has been secured, but the rebels have retained their hold on the oil refinery. This refinery supplies all right, for all easy the peasy. Islands. Start mission. Okay, so there's a problem. I I have to restart the game every time I start a new mission. Cause this game is so bad. The sound shuts off at the beginning of each new mission. That's bad. I mean, as long as I can play it, but man. Operation Red Centaur. Alright. See, the sound's gonna be back on now. And I hit start mission. Secure the refinery. Oh, we got playmores? Shit. Search these dudes. There we go. Anything in the guard post can't open it. Infiltrate facility. All right. Now we're cooking the gas. We got the matrix computer. We got a security camera, which is already on high alert, because they know I'm coming. Anything here? No. SXP International. Alright, let's go and, uh, let's go and mow some enemies down, I guess. Masterpiece of a game here. He's like, uh, he, he bit the table a little too hard there. He's hungry. Damn it, no ragdolls. This looks depressing. What kind of, whatever kind of work this is. I'll just pick up the access card. Alright. What have we got over here? Three five one zero oh, one seven, and then we got like a, a calendar. Oh, it's a car. Okay. 
It says December. We got a very flat keyboard. Oh, we got techno drink now. Cool. We have, we had devil juice, and now we have techno drink. Access loading area, alright. Review, search you, cause you're gonna have ammo, buddy. Go. Got a generator. I like how they're just generic thug looking dudes and bandanas. It's pretty funny. We'll say it's not gonna blow up. Because why would it? Why would it, City Interactive? Okay, what is this way? Mmm. Uh, it's just going back. Okay. So, it's like a shortcut, just in case we miss something like key cards or notes, coded notes, it's fine. Okay, is there anything else we can explore here? This game is pretty linear, so... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright. Go back this way. Hey, sneak into the control center. Yes, sir. Secure the refinery is my other objective. I have accessed the loading area. Checkpoint saved. We got pencils, we got a notepad. We got another door that's locked. One there. Great enemy position, facing away from me. Always face away from your target, if you exist in this game. Dead. Is he dead? I feel like I might have hidden enough times. Hit him enough times. Yup. Yup. There you go. Easy. Okay, I want to... Really, game? They put that lamppost there deliberately. There we go. I was about to say, like, surely... We 
we can take the stealthy route. Clunk, clunk, clunk. Okay, so. Locked. Locked. Checkpoint saved. I'm gonna do some pistoling for a little bit, I guess. Always gotta search everything as well. Just in case. Assault rifle ammo. Good. Oh, we got Icy Flow. Techno Drink and Devil Juice. Icy Flow is the new one. I want to try some Icy Flow. Damn it. <laughs> Guy re didn't really stand a chance, did he? Um, okay, of course. We open the vent, we don't like blow it up. Or like blow it apart. Uh, what have we got here? Ooh. I wonder what's in the vent. I'm curious. So we got to explore everything, right? Is that okay? I don't really know what to expect. Nothing. Alright, it was it was just there. I'm hoping there's a shortcut. I guess if that's what you you wanna take the stealth route. No, that puts me back even further. Okay. Sure. Doodle. <laughs> Right, elevator is out of service. Take the service ladder. Locked. Danger. Alright, we, we might be in for some shit here. Checkpoint save! I'm almost dead. Gotta be really careful. How's it going in Mundo Studios? Welcome to the stream, man. We're playing Combat Task Force 121. It's a military shooter. So far, pretty generic. But, uh... It's just what I need. After all the crap that's been going on. With streaming lately. Alright, the terrorists. The terrorists are making a final stand in the pipeline pump houses. Disable the, the pumps oh. as you progress through the refinery to prevent destruction of the facility. Eliminate all resistance you encounter. Yes, sir. Alright. Yeah, not bad. No, say that pink ring is getting used today. Yeah, I, uh, I brought it. This game is generic, but it's, it's alright. Generic, simple, 
That's, that's all you need, really. And I have to restart the game, um, after... At the beginning of each mission. Because the sound cuts out. At least the gun mechanics and sounds are technically good, especially the accurate reloads and stuff. How's it going, Juice Wallace? Welcome. Yeah, it's, uh, not a bad game at all, aside from restarting. Right, we're on the fourth mission. Operation Crazed Liberty. Yeah, I, uh, brought that Kiriko skin, Edmundo. It's pretty cool. Even though it's, like, technically a reskin. Ta-da! Let's get back in here. Yeah, th I like the weapon animations. The textures are pretty simple. Um... I don't know. I think they fo- I feel like they focused more on the weapons than anything else. What the heck is this? How- what is that for a shortcut? It's like a tiny vent, and why would you want to use a- a tiny vent? With such a short amount of cool space. Okay. Elevator. Level B. Also, let me know if the sound is okay. Put out fires. Alright. going through there. I know where it leads. I think those ventilation shafts are just like shortcuts. What have we got? Let's uh, pull all these levers. Locate propane storage fields. Did I say that right? Yes. I bet, um, I hope Hank Hill is there. He likes his propane. Oh, uh, what have we got? Checkpoint saved. Not bad, not bad. Search you. These guys got stacked. Alright. Okay, I guess we can take the stealth route. There's so many ventilation shafts. Where are we going? This just looks like a really boring maze. Just like, one of you has got to open. I just came through there.
Maybe we have to go through on the ventilation charts. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna assume... That we do. Let's try this one. Hey, I was right. Alright. We're probably back on track now. Oh, we got a shotgun. Wait. Did I? No, of course I didn't. Only the enemy can carry that. Up the stairs. Find and drain the tunnels. I love how we're just shooting same copy and pasted dude every time. Right, that's valve one. Duck under here, checkpoint saved, nice. I haven't died yet. There are no med packs in the uh, levels. So, okay, find access elevator. It's gotta be somewhere. I do. I was not expecting an enemy above me. That's uh that is news. Fuck you! Ah oh, first death. Alright. We start from checkpoint. Dude just came around the corner and ventilated me. <laughs> On guard. All right. Oh, there's the twins. Guys just come out of nowhere. Shut off control pipeline. Right, going up. Bit of damage. Holy crap. I'd actually die. Fuck. Alright. Difficulty's peaking a little bit. Okay, get rid of you. Get rid of you. Of course, this game originally came out on the original Xbox. So, it kind of makes sense that there's no, uh, save system. It's just checkpoints. Shit! You fucking bastard!
Shotguns do so much damage. Probably gonna die here again. Dun, 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 dun. I gotta watch all my sides. I'm gonna get wasted here. Shit. Start from checkpoint. That's tough. <laughs> that one hallway with the shotgunners. Oh! <laughs> His body fell down. I know this engine could do ragdolls. I'm gonna open the door. Yeah, that guy, no good. The guy's rough stuff. The one man with the shotgun. Oh, I can hear him. Ah, oh, I can't shoot him. I can't shoot him through the grate. It's alright. Okay. Up the loft again. Do it again. Anyone else? On a piece of me? No? Alright, good. Yay! It's another mission! They're pretty short, but uh... That one's kind of tough. Rebels have moved from attacking large industrial targets to smaller rural targets in an effort to add a ground swell to the revolt. In particular, they are targeting bridges in an effort to isolate and control small groups to build their support base. You must prevent all bridges from being destroyed, disarm any explosives, and eliminate any and all resistance. Okay, this might be a speed mission. Oh, we got a sniper? Alright, and grenade. Of course, I have to do the routinely restart. Because the sound doesn't work when you start a new mission. Now it should work. Alright, we're on mission five. Jungle Tiger. Let's go. This kind of reminds me of a mission from... Ah, uh, what was it? It was called like Red... Oh, Phantom Ops Red Mercury or something. I can't remember the name right now, but... Shadow Ops Red Mercury. Ah, uh, excuse me, game? Well, can't hit him through certain parts of the bridge. Alright, uh... Who else wants to be sniped?
I heard you. Where are you? What the heck? Dude, where are you? He just took the majority of my- Where are you? What the fuck? Oh, you're there. What the heck? Well, things are taking, like, all my health. Oh, what have we got? It's the first time we've picked up ammo. From like an actual ammo cache. As opposed to a body. Okay. Checkpoint saved. Yeah, with my health, the sub explosive locate the shanty village. The old shanty town. Oh, there's a trap. Alright. Get out of here. Anyone else want some? You? Alright. <laughs> boink, 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 boink. Gather intelligence on the bridge. I just hope my health keeps up. Because... I really can't afford to lose any more health. I'm guessing I have to blow these. There we go. to alert the enemy. They're just casually wandering the bridge. Think I got him. No. Nah. Find a path under the bridge. Alright, objective complete. That dude is still alive. Not anymore. Um. Okay, the briefing did say. Oh shit! Gave me a fright. Dude, I don't have much health. You're gonna fucking take it all away from me. I thought I could like hip fire the sniper. Obviously not. Elevator active.
All right, let's do it again. I uh, need to restart anyway, because my health is going down. Somewhat. Let's just quick scope everything. Right, where's the third man? This uh, music is putting me on edge. Okay, this guy, dude, this, this fucking guy took down all my health last time. There's like nothing I could do. Or well, because I'm like blind as a bat. Do it this time. Nice night patrol, guys. <laughs> Be more alert next time. Okay, open. I know how this works. Okay, hopefully we'll get a checkpoint. I don't, not really too concerned about my health. Okay, down. Headshot. Hip fire headshot. Closed. Could have fooled me. Objectives updated. Alright. Checkpoint saved. Alright, we'll just have to. Oh, I gotta disarm this. Okay, so one. And two. Beat team at the next village. Right, this is our path under the bridge, so... You bastard. Alright. Alright, I don't have much health to begin with, so. <sighs> Enemy are very fast to re react. That completely took me off guard, because I thought the path was going to be somewhat empty. So, if I throw this, grenade, grenade, you're still alive? Dead. In cold blood. Alright. I've got a feeling some dude is going to clip out of nowhere. 
need to be really quiet. Don't you dare. Not gonna lie, this pistol is pretty fun to use. Checkpoint <laughs> <laughs> saved! The sniper should at least one shot. That's kind of silly. something else happening? I don't think I can go up there either. Oh, let's continue. It's a 50 cal- yeah, exactly! Just like, uh, Far Cry 3 Juice Wars. It should one-shot. And all other games, have you seen 50 cals? In, like, all other games? Obviously, I've never fired one in real life, but I imagine it would just, like, completely shatter someone. Because of that, uh, because of that nuzzle on the end of it. Oh, there's my team. Alright. This is probably one of the first or second games that the sniper is completely useless. Hello, sir. All right. <laughs> oh, man. The rebels now hold only a single remaining bridge, but it controls access in and out of one of the larger urban areas. You must first secure the bridge and then defend it from any and all counterattack. Start mission. All right, we got a we got a full light machine gun here. Um, the minute we shoot someone with fifty cal, will leave a hole the size of a sunroof in you. Yeah, one hundred percent. Like, there's no reason for this game to have like a weak sniper when this game is like really. Nice, realistic weapon models and animations. Like, I totally agree on that as well. Okay. Looks like we're gonna be, like, just mowing down a bunch of dudes now. Full Rambo. Locate the village for intel. Defend the bridge from attack. Okay. Yeah, 50 cows and AK-47s are messy weapons. Like, they just shred. They would just shred your target. Ridiculous fire rate. Probably M1s as well. M1s are pretty ridiculous. Oh! Uh, you owned a few AKs. They were super nice. Do they have, like, major kickback? Because they go dunk, 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 dunk. Uh, locate the villager for intel. Open the vehicle gate. Okay. I'd say they're pretty loud as well. Whereabouts do you live, by the way? To, uh, own a firearm. You must be in the US. Well, you don't see that in certain models since Florida is really hard to get in use. I see. 
Yeah, and like a Afghanistan, they like manufacture them. They just like snap them together and like they've got a... They've got a weapon. <laughs> I got like a full, fully fledged fresh firearm. Ow! I don't mean to hit that. Checkpoint saved. Let's blow up all the barrels. I probably don't need to reload as much as I am. This being. An LMG. Love the sound of this thing. Okay. moves the belt feed over. That's a really nice touch. They put a lot of effort into these firearm animations. And other games of like belt fed ammo, you hear like a satisfying snap sound. Oh, that opens the gate. Old AKs are basically made from sheet metal. Damn. Like the, um, SMGs? Like what the Nazis used? In, uh, World War II, I think? You can see, like, the seams of those weapons. Of those, uh, machine guns. But they were really basic. They were really effective, but uh, basic submachine submachine guns. Yeah, yeah, the grease guns. You know the ones in like Medal of Honor, Allied Assault, like the basic ones. They go da 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 da. Yeah. You know the ones I mean. Actually, all the, uh, Medal of Honor games, for that matter. Alright. Picked up the keys. Fuck, where are you? Not gonna take my health down that easy. Really need more ammo. 14 rounds. You've been a gunsmith for 10 years, so you've owned, worked on, did your fair share of cool firearms. Have you uh, fired a ball pup before? From uh, Counter Strike? Those are pretty cool. They've got. They're like kind of green, and they're like slanted, and they've got a scope. I think they're called a bullpup anyway. Oh, AUG, yeah. Yeah, I've, uh, I've definitely heard that name. I would say, uh, mini guns are illegal. Can you get, like, Gatling guns somewhere in the US? Those would be, like, heavy, because they got, like, the carry handle and everything. Under cover of night, the remaining rebels have begun to converge into the cities and outlying areas, wreaking havoc and destroying targets of opportunity to create unrest among the population. Food convoys from relief agencies are a favorite target. 
You must find and secure a food convoy that has been reported hijacked in the last two hours. Okie dokie. Find the food convoy. Again, we gotta restart the game because the sound just shuts off. For no apparent reason. You get to see my whole desktop again. Load. Alright. Uh, out ragged tension. Mission. Three, six, seven. Mission seven. Alright. Food convoy. Secure the UN food truck. We got a quaint wee village. We got a nice plant here. Nice 3D plant. On the hostages. Those others of Volcut Pup style are the uh, Styorg, uh, Famous, IWX95, FMP90. I've heard the P90, yes. And yes, you get a Gatling gun because they're not full auto. Okay. Are they just like. Duh, 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 duh. So, anything that's full auto, you can't get. If there's like a switch to like burst fire or something. It's fair enough. Like a start stop sort of um firing pattern. Checkpoint saved. Tell you get a full auto, but you need tax, stamps, and certain paperwork. Okay. Um. So I say everything is semi-auto, pump, or single shot. Man, pump sounds satisfying. What does pump action feel like? It must be so cool. Or even like a, uh, a double barreled shotgun. All sound pretty sick to fire. Got a few shotguns, not bad, depends what you can handle to be honest. Yeah. Um, what made you want to become a gunsmith? In the first place? Have you just been really into guns, or have you been military drafted? Alright, oh, there's gotta be a key round, I guess. Somewhere around here, there's, like, a key? Aha! Uh -huh. Gotcha. I thought there was something on that, uh, bulletin board? Or billboard, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, I guess the kickback of a shotgun. Down to depending if- What's wrong with that guy's face? He's like, really sunburned or something. I mean, he is- he has been a hostage, or... These twins. Secure hostages. Okay. It was random actually, he worked for a GM store, because a buddy of mine is badger and never looked back. He also have degrees in tech. 
security and all that jazz. That'll definitely get your foot on. Awesome, man. Right, secure hostages? I don't know how to secure them. Interesting. Eliminate enemy resistance. <laughs> Resist yonts. <laughs> I don't know why I said it like a French. Enemy resist yonts. Uh... Three chairs and no table. Come on, guys. You gotta have a table. Unless you're like... Smoking cigarettes and drinking under the house. Then chairs are a fair enough uh, design choice. Guessing we can like clip the wire? Yeah. Alright. What an animation that was. One frame. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Get out of here. Love these weapon sounds. Oh, do we have intel uh, uh, intelligence? You found some ammo, okay. Got this. There's no feng shui that in that terrorist space. There is not. Probably because they're terrorists and they don't care. No feng shui indeed. It's all pretty bare bones. They're just getting ready for their next uh, attack, I guess. No beds either. Just a bunch of cardboard and cloth. Some bed sheets are hung up as well. Oh shit. Um, and if we beat this game, I have another game set up. Which came out a year later. Uh, developed by a different company. Okay, let's restart from the checkpoint. Damn it! <laughs> Gotta do it again. I guess we're not too far back, but hell. But yeah, the next game is slightly more, like, polished. And it's developed by Eidos. Same people who made the original Tomb Raider. It's, uh, it's still polished jank though, you know? Always gotta have jank, otherwise... Nothing is a challenge. If it's not jank, it's not a challenge. It's, it's gotta play slightly bad. By rule of thumb. Alright, we did it. Mission completed. The original Delta Force FP game, FPS games are ran on PC. The US I already Ambassador's played a bit of Black Hawk Down. When AA missiles were fired as his helicopter attempted to land on the embassy roof. He was then ordered to escape by convoy. The convoy was attacked and his vehicle was separated from it. While the ambassador has been rescued, his car needs to be located, inspected, and any intelligence documents retrieved. Alright, intelligence documents. As usual, we gotta quit our game. And we gotta go back in. Because the game does the thing with the sound. Um, yeah, I need to get round to the Delta Force games. Those seem pretty cool. Alright. 
sweeping saber. Operation sweeping saber. Find and destroy the chemical lab. The first one from 9899, cool, it worked on your old shit PC at the time, nice. I have a Pentium 3 behind me, with uh, Windows 98, and like 512 megabytes of RAM, it's got a 233 uh, MMX, GeForce 2 MX400 graphics card. It's pretty decent. It's really good for DOS. There's chickens! Oh, damn it! There's static model chickens. One of those 3D effects cards would be nice to have. Yeah, like a Voodoo, Voodoo 3 3000 Edmundo. But, um... I was told just to stick with my GeForce 2 400, whatever it's called. Oh shit! I didn't mean to launch a grenade, buddy. GeForce 2 MX 400, yeah. But uh, yeah, buying a... Uh, a motherboard that supports a Voodoo 3 3000. And just like getting a CRT monitor set up and everything. IBM Model M keyboard with the clicky keys. Like just the whole dream setup, basically. Would be pretty sick. Well, we got music. How's it going, Life Fox? Welcome to the stream, man. We're playing some combat task force one, two, one. So far, not a bad game. It's, uh, entertaining enough. Have you been playing more Overwatch in Mundo? Uh, it's a shame a game like this one, we need software like Voodoo Graphic make it work correctly. Uh, honestly, I just ran the installer and I'm on Windows 10. And the game just installed and ran flawlessly. I'm not using any retro hardware or anything. This is just sort of, dare I say it, plug and play, basically. How's it going, William? It's weird when PC games are like console games. This originally came out on the OG Xbox, William, because it uses checkpoint systems, or it uses a checkpoint system. So yeah, it, it typically... Literally is a console game. You played a little last night just moving your way through the battle pass? Nice. Yeah, I want to get the uh, Moira Mythic skin or Mystic skin. That's like uh, levy level 80 of the battle pass. I already can't talk. Uh, Sojourn is really good at the moment. Yeah, I've, um, I've played a bit with her as a teammate in quick play. And it seems like she's gone on better. Like her whole player stats have gone on better. I think you're level 60 or something. I'm like 20. 
Uh, but I'm actually gonna try and complete the battle pass this time. Because I really want that Moira skin. But, uh, how you doing, Billion? Much better, especially with a Mercy buff. That's good. That's a good compensation. From the GPU, emulate wildly, physics, graphic, games, 2000, 2009, Um, not this game, but a lot of games do on Windows 10. Have, uh, weird artifacting. Yeah, fix the shot, you need, like, DG Voodoo. Exactly, yeah, already fixed. But, uh, thankfully with this game, it, it runs perfectly. Where am I going? Um, find and destroy the chemical lab. Find the secret documents. Uh, I'm confused. I think I have to go back. Okay, I'm just gonna go back. Gonna... I guess thoroughly search? I don't know what we're supposed to be searching right now, but... Sometimes GOG releases aren't perfect. Steam releases are even worse sometimes. So you sort of gotta find your own means to play a game. Ah. Alright, barbed wire I forgot. Let's see, let's see. Search. Grenade launcher ammo. That's not gonna help. Right, looking for documents. I'm like sort of lost now. Oh, I'm glad it's all I got to fix an old game might work. Uh, CD, DVDs to crack. Yeah, no CD. You make it work with no CD, bunch of patch. Um, make it work. Worth it in the end. Yeah, it saves you doing that big workaround. Yeah, it, it saves you, like, you know, downloading files you're unsure of or going to websites you're unsure of and, and uh, getting it illegitimately. But some games you have to because they're not available on either of those services. Exactly, yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's a whole lot of trial and error sometimes. Unfortunately. I've, uh, I've been there many times, especially in my, in my past two years of streaming. I've had to go well out of my way, above and beyond. Um... Especially for the types of games I play as well. Like they're not really available anymore. Anywhere. Or anymore. And uh, living in New Zealand, like, to buy physical copies, if I were to buy a physical copy, they're so expensive. Like, shipping prices from point A to point B are ridiculous. It depends, though. So, some games you just need to, uh, yeah. Oh, they're the documents. Man, I'm a blind idiot. Okay, find access card for the lab. Oh, right in the boot of the car. 
Uh, the Wizards of the Great is the game in the middle of the game. Do the same area twice. Yeah, crash glitch. And then there's like some kind of obscure patch out there you never knew about. Yeah, some games you just can't like get through. Because of game breaking bugs. 100%. And some games are just so bad that they don't even have playthroughs on YouTube. Or like, people didn't even bother getting through them. <laughs> that they weren't even, like, worth a upload. Or anything. Like, there are some major crap shoots out there. In, uh, in gaming. Four grenade launcher rounds, yep. Stuff I don't use, game. Shit I don't use. Oh! I used that by accident. Crap. You took like two grenade hurts. Your guy has GL and I die through buzzers, destroy the essence of this game, blood riot, blood rain, shadow man make it perfect. Yep. Um Dark Forces Remaster is out in like three hours. I'm hype. I'm gonna buy it. Even though the force engine exists, I'm still gonna buy it. How's it going, White, Ra White Magic Raven? Welcome. What's up, man? We are playing Combat Task Force 121. Military shooter. It's not bad. Hope you're well, man. Oh! Got the say prompt up. Okay, we got the access card. Like get into the lab. Here we go. Du -du -du -du. Did the game just crash? No. What are you doing? That's the first crash. All right. Whatever. Guess the game need to crash at some point. I gotta reset the mission. Thanks, game. I hope it doesn't crash like that next time. Destroy the chemical lab. God damn it. Yeah, I see what you mean. I wasn't expecting this game to crash, though. That's the thing. Well, at least the missions are short. Played Euro 2000, damn. Simulation so realistic, you learn how to take off. Can't land the airplane so hard. Eurofighter. I've never heard of that one. It does sound very Euro, though. Very European. I'm almost dead. Restart from checkpoint. Alright. Ok, 
Okay, I need to put the fear of God on that guy, because he took out the majority of my health. Here we go. Need to fire off some warning shots. So I'm guessing it's a jet fighter game, uh, Raven? Can I loot this dude? Oh, I can. It's pixel perfect, though. Fuck you! Pixel precise. God damn it. Bloody game. Gotta concentrate. This came out of nowhere. Airplane War of 16 versus other planes. Sounds fun. Right, where is the other man? loot the sky again? Be nice. Okay, whatever. I can't. Warning shots. Where's that other dude? It's a guy going psycho with a shotgun somewhere. Where is he? There he is. Not today. I just see the checkpoint. So I don't have to do this all over again. Let's see. Ow. Ow, man. Dude. You and your accuracy. It's not bad. Not bad. checkpoint as well. Oh! Damn it! You just 
folded under the stairs. Fuck! There he is. Ah! Can load his feet. There we go. Ow, dude! Really gotta watch my sides here. Okay. I got no health. Fuck! See? Okay, there's my checkpoint. I was about to get pissed then. I don't have a good checkpoint. You can't. How's it going, gamer tragic? Welcome to the stream. How you doing, man? We're playing some... Combat Task Force. One, two, one. It's uh, not bad. It's a little frustrating. Because there are no actual med kits in the game. You gotta you gotta use our uh, tactical strategy. Alright, will the game crash? Been lurking a while, thank you for the lurk. The game crashed again in the exact same spot. Oh no. Oh no, that's not good. That means it is indeed a game breaking bug. Oh boy, I'm gonna try one more time, and then we'll probably have to switch game. Oh man, okay. <laughs> That's GG. I think. Honestly, don't know how to fix that. Because the game has been working as well as it can be up to this point. Give it one more chance here. Then, uh... Might have to switch game. One isn't cooperating. crashing on yeah then it is it is it's crashing in the exact same spot and it's done it twice so I'm a little worried we might not be able to beat this game how's it going Eugene welcome to the stream what's happening man all right, let's try this one more time. If it crashes again, um, I'll switch game. Because it's crashed twice consecutively. On the same area. Which, uh, sucks. Just 
Let's go to some cup noodles, crispy bacon flavor. Nice. Are those are uh, magi or fantastic noodles? Because uh, both are good choices. Fantastic. Okay, that is fantastic. I like our uh, fantastic oriental flavor. Now nah, this time you'll get through going all the way, man. Uh, thanks for having faith in me. All the fucking way. Alright, well, we'll see. Indeed, yep. I miss our uh, Magi chicken noodles. Before... They changed their recipe of the sachet. Like old school Magi chicken noodles. I like beef and oriental fantastic noodles though. But yeah, just like shapes, Magi changed their recipe. And it's bullshit. It just tastes like nothing now. Alright. So what's the bet it's gonna crash? You do remember I hate when they keep ch Yeah, exactly. What's the bet it's gonna crash through this doorway? And we're gonna have to, um... We'll have to switch games if it crashes. Three, two, one. We got through the doorway without it crashing. Probably because I blow up the barrels in the background. Alright, cool. We can keep playing the game. You prefer, uh, thick noodles? Called it. No, you didn't. You didn't call shit. <laughs> Thanks for the clap. I mean, the clap. Like, actual clap, not... That came out wrong. That came out so wrong that I had to explain it. Oh, we're in a chemical lab. But yes, uh, thanks for having faith, William. Gotta have faith, man. Is that a turntable? No, it's a lab. It's not a turntable. Never known anyone to be excited about getting it. <laughs> man. I've, uh, I've never had one and I don't intend to. Um, find and destroy chemical lab. Destroy the lab. Like, do I just shoot everything in the lab? Objectives updated. Okay, we did it. You like how they had icon constantly appear over the people, people's dead asses? Yeah, the hand. The rebels have taken over a few high-rise buildings downtown. You need to advance on foot and secure the area. Yes, sir. All right, as usual, we need to exit to windows because the sound uh, shuts off when you enter every new mission. I'm going to stop explaining it, but yeah, the sound stops working. All right, Operation Silver Strike. What's this, mission 10? We got a shotgun. Alright, it's time to shotgun. Gain access downtown. Uh, world's weakest shotgun, by the way. Got the 
Okays. Speaking of all fusing the pistol, honestly. Such a nice model, yeah. United States Army Incorporated. 12 gauge UA. It's pretty sick. I wish I could just go around the corner and bam, you know? I think that's the Half Life 2 reload sound of the shells. Which is kind of funny. I got a key for that. It's us. It is! It's the Half-Life 2 reload sound. It's pretty funny. Stolen asset. Shot kills at close range. Hitting center or mass. We'll see. That was one shot. Alright, all the shells directed. We'll try that again. Checkpoint saved. Okay, we'll go up here first. He just got flat cannoned. Dude seems super happy to be shot. Yeah, <laughs> jump to joy. All the way to the top of the pole. That dude couldn't even get off the ground quick enough. All right. Secure sector B. Black. Oh man, I've been wanting to play Black for years in Mundo. I don't know why I haven't. But that game looks amazing. I was um I was actually watching a review on it the other day. Yeah, Black looks sick. It's like exclusively for the um original Xbox as well. Yeah, definitely gonna need to play that someday. The weapons look amazing. Like, the whole game just looks like a riot. I remember when it first came out as well. Like, it was all over the shelves. I don't know why I didn't play it. Surely I would have been interested in it back then, because I've been into FPS games since the beginning of time. Like, that's all I played at, um, at a point in time. It was purely just FPS games. Oh, I was on PS2 as well. Okay. I'm thinking because it looked better on Xbox. Juice Wallace. Because I remember, like, Xbox games looked a lot better than PS2 counterparts. I think it ran better as well. Yeah. Yeah. It was backwards compatible. I'm definitely going to buy it because I got a 360. And an original Xbox. But, um, yeah, all games look better on Xbox. Like, performance-wise as well, they ran a lot smoother. 
No hate to PS2 owners, of course, but games just ran a lot better. They looked a lot better. Mission. There is a broadcast antenna on the top floor of a building under construction. The rebels are using it to broadcast propaganda that is keeping the conflict alive. You must destroy the antenna, secure the building, and reach your extraction point above the skyline. Um, I have not played Shell Shock Vietnam. No. I played another game, it was like Operation Red Mercury. Um, it was a Spec Ops game, I think, but no. You had certain games and certain systems at that point? Ah, I see. Yeah, so you, you just happened to have black on the PS2. That makes sense. Right, what mission are we on? Four... Seven... Eight, nine, ten. Uh, mission eleven. Operation Flaming Hammer. Alright. Yo, we got cars? Destroy broadcast antenna. But, uh, yes, Eugene, I have heard about Shellshock Nam. Seems interesting. Okay. Look around the corner here. Okay, we've got a locked door, we got phones. Let's head down the ramp. It probably would have been a good moment for a grenade, honestly. I mean, these days are the little time, so they must have done something right, especially RPG. Yeah, definitely RPG, Juice Wallace. That was massive on the PS2. And fighting. But, um, yeah, all I'm saying is stuff evidently ran better on the original Xbox at the time. But yes, the uh, PS2 did have its library of games. Like, a good health, a good dose of games. So like, it's not all bad. I remember all my friends had PS2. Opposed to Xbox. Not only it seemed to never run out of hard drive space. Yeah, they had a uh, bigger hard drives. Like, they were all built in as well. So good. I had a PS1, and then I got an Xbox. Then I got an Xbox 360. Later down the line, I got a Sega Saturn. Uh, Sega Mega Drive of CD extension. And a Super Nintendo. Su Super Nintendo. 8 gig hard drive? Yeah, and then the 360 just doubled that. Even tripled that. Do I go... Do I go in here? No. Oh, we're gonna start the generator, okay. 
Sega CD had some OP games, same with the Saturn. Oh, definitely. Yeah. I believe they've got like Echo the Dolphin, Road Avenger. I've got a couple of like mech and space games as well for the Sega CD. You've been repairing a few 360s recently? Get to the roof, checkpoint save. Alright. I really want a 3DO or CDI console. That's right, I said it. I want a CDI. Because CDI seems awesome. Smart idea. Hell yeah. How big a hard drive did you put on Edmundo? I'm sure you could go like max capacity. 3DO had like Killing Time and the Road Rash port, which is really good. Like its own version of Road Rash. I think it was Road Rash 3D. Um, what else? Wolfenstein 3D. Really nice port of that. Go higher modder? Damn, 500 gig. I don't need all that space. Because I've stopped playing my 360. I mean, I've, I've got some physical 360 games behind me, but I, like, barely play it. So, I don't know. Unless you, like, pick it up every now and again and play it. Kinda cool. One terabyte. I really like the uh, ambience in this level. Probably gonna die soon though. No music, just like. The sound of the city street, you know? Right, anyone else up here? I really want a checkpoint. down. Headshot. Oh, I got next to nothing health left. Shit. Fuck. Alright. Where's my checkpoint? It's here. Fair enough. Fuckers, man. Oh. 
I got some decent pop shots on me. <coughs> yeah, I got all the ammo. This checkpoint was a wee way back, huh? That's a bit better. I'm gonna go gung ho up here, I think. Where are you? Fuck! Where are you? You took away all my health last time. Okay. Death from above, I goose. An environment, so enemy definitely have a drop point on me. Okay. This music's stalking me, man. What explosives on the antenna? Dead. Shit. Do we need to turn our generator on? Here comes the victory music. There it is. Exit level. Uh, where am I exiting the level? Oh, there we go. I'm guessing... Gotta do a bit of hippity hoppity. Oh! <laughs> no! <laughs> I thought I had to jump across! We start from checkpoint. Did I just committed suicide? Oh man! So it doesn't specifically say where to exit the level. Let's try that again.
Yep. I am a winner. So you gotta, you gotta jump before it like glides over. And Eugene, thank you very much for gifting a sub to Punisher Max. Really appreciate it. Ah, uh, that's the game. Combat. Abby, welcome to the stream. Winner indeed. Task Force 121. Really appreciate that gifted sub. But yes, that was the game. Um, I do have another game tonight. So, we're going to wait for these credits, and then uh, I'm going to put on the next game. Which I already forgot the name of, so... We're just going to wait here. <laughs> My memory is really freaking bad these days. Thanks for the GG's. Oh, that was fun. Like, some of these short budget games are pretty cool. Like, that was short, stupid, and fun. Groove games. I can tell you the next game was developed by Eidos. Who made, uh, the Tomb Raider games. But, uh, I gotta remember the... Gotta remember the title. Operations Manager, Benjamin Huxley. Visit us online at GrooveGames.com. Compatibility testing by Bug Tracker. Original music composed and produced by Iron Inon Zor Zur Groove Media Inc. All rights reserved. Groove Games and Groove Logo are trademarks of Groove Media Incorporated. Combat Task Force One Two One is a registered trademark of Groove Media Inc. Direct Action Games Logo trademark. Combat Task Force One Two One. Short and sweet. Powered by Unreal Engine. Really shitty. <laughs> really shittily powered by Unreal Engine. Alright, back. Quit. Next game. You know what the next game is called? Commandos Strike Force. Let me set it up. Alright, let's just put on some music. But, uh, thank you guys for hanging around. Let me set up the next game. Commandos Strike Force. Developed by Eidos. Oh no, developed by Pyro Studios. Published by Eidos. It does indeed. This came out in two.